My name is Nick. This is the Mini Foger Delay Pedal by Moog. This pedal is a simplified version of what would be the many versions of the MF-104 Analog Delay Moger Foger Pedal. This pedal is the only one in the Mini Foger line to not have a tone knob. This one actually has a drive knob, and uh, I'm going to actually turn that drive knob all the way down, and I'll, I'll tell you why in a second. But uh, we have the time, feedback, and mix knobs. Those are pretty standard uh, delay pedal. Uh, knobs and uh, I'll tell you what, let me just go ahead and just strum a chord here. Now I'll let you in on a little secret. This particular pedal is actually a prototype um, and I was told that the drive knob is actually dirtier than what you would get in a normal production unit. Um, so I don't have anything to compare to but this drive knob will actually get you a little bit of uh, distortion. Now that thing is really hot. I'm going to go ahead and just turn the mix all the way down. So I'm really happy that I have this uh, prototype unit. Uh, we'll go ahead and turn the drive knob. I'm going to turn this all the way back down because I honestly don't have anything to compare to. I'm going to turn that mix back up here. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'll tell you what, let's turn that time down. All right, so if we have the time knob turned all the way down, it's at 35 milliseconds, and it goes all the way up to 700 milliseconds. I'm going to go ahead and leave that all the way down, and... Okay, I'm going to turn the feedback up just so you can hear that. Let's do this. I'm going to turn the feedback all the way down. Uh, I'm going to do that. Uh, tell you what, let's get the mix up a little bit. And We start to get uh, normal, I would say normal, uh, delay. Okay. Now, right in that range, it really starts to run away a little bit. Thank you. 
And of course we can get that runaway when we turn the f feedback all the way up. Let's turn that mix back all the way up, and this is what it sounds like. The delay is the only pedal in the Mini Fogger line where you can set one of two parameters with the expression pedal input. There's a switch inside that allows you to switch between the feedback or the time, and you can control either one uh, with the EP3. This one is actually set for feedback, so I'm going to go ahead and plug that in. And I'm going to set the feedback down and leave the mix up. I'm going to turn the drive back down. And time, we'll just leave that right there. I'll tell you what, we're going to add the uh, boost pedal on as well. the inside of that pedal here. Now the inside of that right there it says feedback in time. I'm going to switch that to time. Okay, let me just go ahead and leave that right there. Okay, and let's see. Let's leave the feedback up like this and I'm going to turn the time back down. Actually, we'll just go all the way down. Okay, let's go ahead and unplug that. And there is something I want to... Okay, now th since this pedal is true bypass, it will cut off your delay repeats. <laughs> so, something to keep in mind if you're uh, working with this thing. So that is the Mini Foger Delay Pedal by Moog. Thanks for watching, and please be sure to check out the other videos. Thanks.